Okay, I'm sorry, I got sidetracked. My name is Matthew Marcel, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for having me. Two Jasons, or I'm sorry, Jason Taller uh, asked me if I would MC this evening. And I said, of course, man, I would love to do that. What do you want me to do as the MC? And you guys know how strict Jason is. He said, whatever you want, man, whatever you want. So I'm here, I'm gonna MC it, I'm gonna play a couple songs. And if you don't know anything about me, you need to know one thing, and that is this. I'm a bad motherfucker. Yeah. I'm a bad motherfucker. I got the crib walk kinda clean. I ain't saying I'm the motherfucker. No, I'm just saying that I've been on the scene. Now you can call my mama And she gonna tell you to the phone She gonna tell you I'm a bad motherfucker huh. I am bad to the bone I ain't got a dime But my walk's worth a million dollars The job gonna give me money But this walking got to get Can you call your mama and tell the woman who you with? Now she gonna tell you something. She can tell you through the phone. She gonna tell you I'm a bad motherfucker. Yeah, I'm bad to the bone. Well, I ain't got a dime, but my walk's worth a million. The job gon' give me money, but this walking down to get me paid. The timing is for walking, so I think I'm going to walk this way. Way, 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 walk this way. Got coffee in Copenhagen sitting in the refrigerator. Broken bottles on the floor and a table strewn with rolling papers. We got kisses on the window, blood on the floor, broken chairs in the kitchen and an open front door. And I'm walking outside where the telephone hires hung wire. We got an ashtray overflowing. From talking last night about a life we were living, living in sin. We were crazy, we were broke, but the shit we did, we call living. Well, last night was wild for a Wednesday. We drank whiskey from the bottle and wondered why we could never get laid. Played cards in the kitchen. It was a game of kings. When the jacks were thumbs, and we were silver queens. It was a hell of a night in the middle of the week. We were Midwest boys, but we were living like kings. We had a table made of plywood. With a red solo cars of people dancing in the living room Like the rug was cut Well, Bobby broke a bottle Johnny smashed a chair and Tommy hollered out Hey, who the hell cares this is living? Yeah, last night was wild for a Wednesday 
smoked way too much marijuana And wondered why we could never get laid They cards in the kitchen Was a game of kings When the jacks were thugs And we were sitting with queens It was a hell of a night We were Midwest boys, but we were living like kings. The other cops say came around about five in the morning, and we all could agree that we should call it a night. But they left us there in our own lawn chairs, cigarettes burning till the dawn. Did appear to try to make sense of our own lives. We played cards in the kitchen It was a game of kings When the jacks were thugs And we were sitting with queens It was a hell of a night In the middle of the week We were Midwest boys And we were living like kings It was the middle of the week But one hell of a night some Midwest boys who are doing all right. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you so much. So if you just stumbled in here and you were not invited on the uh, social medias and everything, what we have right here is a little songwriter's troupe, and so you're not going to hear a lot of cover songs. Um, however, I'm going to play a song anyway. This goes back to uh, my dispatch fans. It was a decorated general with a heart of gold And like a gem to all the stories he told Of past battles won and lost and legends of old A seasoned veteran of his own time On the battlefield he gained respectful fame With many medals of bravery and straps to his name He grew a bit as soon as he could A couple of scars on his face And always urged his men on But on the eve of great battle with the victory He rubbed up to sleep And wrestled with the meaning He awoke from the night to tell what he had seen he walked slowly out of his tent. All the men held tall with their chest in the air, with their courage in the fire, and the fire in their stand. It was a gray morning, they all wondered how they would fare. The old general told them to go home. He said, I have seen the others, and I have discovered that this fight is not worth fighting. And I've seen their mothers, and I will shower and shine your shoes you got no time to lose you're young man you must be living take your shower and shine your shoes you got no time to lose you're young man you must be living god now you all forgive me sorry about that part right there <laughs> But not a man moved, their eyes gazed straight ahead till one by one they set back. Not a word was said, the old general was left with his own words echoing his head. Let me bring out a bed. Hold on. All the men held fast with their guns on their shoulders, not knowing what to do with the contradicting orders. The general said he was doing his own duty, but he extended no further. Men could go as they pleased. But not a man moved, their eyes gazed straight ahead till one by one they stepped back. And not a word was said, the old general was left with his own words echoing in his head. He then prepared to fight, he said I have seen the others And I have discovered That this fight is not worth fighting Whoa. And I've seen their mothers And I will no other To follow me where I'm going So take your shower and shine your shoes 
choose. You got no time to lose. You're young man, you must be living. <laughs> Take your shower and shine your shoes. We got no time to lose. You're young man, you must be living. Well, go now, you are forgiven. Thank you, God, for indulging me. Yeah, man. Ladies and gentlemen, I'm bringing up on the stage right here, Stuart Poe on the slide guitar. Help me. Yeah, he'll, uh, you'll see him get pulled up here a couple times tonight. And uh, this is one of those times. I'll get started while you come in. She liked the way that the fire burned. She smelled a little bit like jazz She looked like she could dance for a dollar And cut a man right in half Now she don't call me cause she crazy She only call me in the heat She calling now because we burning up And I got just what she need Gasoline She won it cause it's gasoline We got to have it My woman got to have it for the gas I got a ghillie suit with boxes of matches I got a lot of gasoline I got a man standing outside my window And he is looking right at me He got a nine millimeter at his waistband He got a couple magazines He wanna know where I'm going I said, no, hand. I'm gonna burn some gasoline Rocking the ghillie suit Yeah Check out my ghillie suit Well I'm going north and I'm gonna burn some gas Rockin' the ghillie suit Behind the ghillie suits, a hundred different spiders Inside the yellow colored jars And there's some creepy crawly creatures in the back seat But I don't know where they are I swear they were here just a minute ago Can you check by the gasoline? You know, sir, I'm not sure I only been a bit once But now I'm one of them And they all want to me inside my ghillie suit Yeah Check out my ghillie suit well, I'm going north and I'm gonna buy some motherfucking gas Rockin' the ghillie suit Thank you again, ladies and gentlemen, that's Stuart Pope. And we're gonna do one more for you. Now, if you're liking what you're hearing, uh, let me hear you say one time. <laughs> well, if you like what you hear, let me hear you scream. Yeah! All right. Well, if you like what you're hearing, on April 20th, that's 420, by the way, we are gonna celebrate the holidays right back here 
at Moon Drops Distillery. So uh, I'll be here. I'm gonna rope Sue coming. I'm gonna get two Jasons to come out. And you all might as well join us anyway. Now, if you don't know what the holidays are on 420, let me show you. Well, I'm smoking marijuana and I'm drinking whiskey tonight. I got a bad woman laying in the bed and she'll be waiting all night. I got an old guitar and the song I've been waiting to play. I'm gonna burn a little marijuana scent Moon Drops Distillery bourbon Well, this guitar I've been playing for days I swear one of these weeks I'm gonna blow up into outer space I got a couple new songs And they're playing on the radio Stevie, but until he gets here, I'm gonna play this one. Again, we are songwriters from Indiana, Central Indiana. Everybody thinks you need to go to Nashville, Tennessee to play music, and you really don't. So this is my fuck Nashville song. Well, I don't know many people who live in Nashville, and I don't know if they'll be too fond of me. I got a slow right hand and a broke guitar A microphone stand and a gun in the car Yeah, I don't know if it'll be too well for me But I sent my songs down to Nashville And they say a couple of them can really ring So now I'm selling the house and I'm packing the car I'm quitting my job and I'm killing my dog And I'm heading on south to Nashville, Tennessee 
Oh, and my woman got a baby in her arm. And she says, car seats are going to kill more kids than me. Well, she like cold beer and a game of darts, heavy metal music and the engine that starts and she dances like the devil on LSD. Come on, Steve. Types of music down in Nashville, and they say my sound ain't nothing they never seen. They got mean guitars and quiet bars, million dollar pickers with million dollar hearts, but my baby says ain't none of them can dance like me. Woo! Ladies and gentlemen, that is Stevie. Do not adjust your glasses. He really is that good looking. I'm going to do one more for you tonight in, in honor to Jason's album release party. Stick around. You guys are about to get your knock socked off. Knock. Yeah. Your socks are going to be somewhere else after Chris Wolf plays. I wrote this song because this is why we live in Indiana. Summer's on its way down in Athens, Georgia, where the heavy heat is high. There ain't much north of West Virginia, at least there's nothing that's worth the drive. There's a southern way of living life in the summertime. Along the mountains on the Appalachian Trail and the Dixie Line. These Midwest women are all raising their children and they're having a hell of a time. They say the days are long, but the nights ain't all that bad. It's just the darkest before the night. There's a Midwest way of living life right. Between the waters round in Michigan and the Ohio. Oh, and I know it's not the high life to live in Indiana. But my cousin cut a record and we're going to his show tonight. Ooh.
All right, let's hang out. So like I said, uh, Jason Taller gave me the honor of being the master of ceremonies and I can do whatever I want. And so I'd just like to point out something. This tip jar, I get to claim all the money in the tip jar because he said whatever I want. So if you put any of that money in the tip jar, it's going to go to me. And maybe I'll share it with all the talent that is coming up here like Chris Wolf, Steve, uh, Stuart Poe, Stevie, Elizabeth's coming up later. I'm telling you guys, we got some good people here. But just a real quick story about this guy coming up. I truly would not be here in this environment with you all if it wasn't for this man right here. And when we're young and we're kids and we're rock and roll stars in the future, we dream about making it. And we, we don't know what that really looks like except for just traveling the world and, you know, banging porn stars. I don't know. However, when you're coming up in the Indianapolis songwriting community, you meet legendary people. And this is one of the legendary people. This is the most famous person that no one's ever heard of. Ladies and gentlemen, big round of applause for Chris Wolf. I'm gonna see if I can bring some energy into the show. I mean, up here doing all these ballads and shit. Hey, let's give it up for two Jasons putting together a hell of a party. Do you think anybody's going to show up? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all here. How's your mom and them? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all came. Let the fun begin. We're so glad to see you came. If you weren't here, wouldn't be the same. Pretty sure it'd be pretty lame. Well, I'm pretty sure. Just saying. But you're all here and it's all good. We'll treat you like my mama would. We'll have fun, at least we should. We can take you home if we could. Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all here. How's your mom and them? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all came. Let the fun begin. I'm gonna pick one now. Good to see you smile, always did. Like your style, but stop right there. Don't touch that dial. We ain't done, we ain't through. We got more in store for you. Get you dancing, singing too. We like to party, how about you? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all here. How's your mom and them? Hey, how y'all doing? Hey, how y'all been? Glad y'all came, hope you come again. Glad y'all came, hope you come again. How 
Garden. Thanks, man. Um, I just got to say something about these guys that are putting this party together tonight. They, they give me a lot of credit where I don't deserve it. They are just a talented couple of guys that wandered into my open mic one night and they started performing and everything happened and they're a hit and I, all I did was go, you guys are good, man. And then they give me all the credit for it, so. I guess you're welcome. <laughs> this song's about my truck. It is a Chevy. But I will but I will not help you move. You just might have yourself some junk Don't you worry, don't get in a funk As it turns out, looks like you're in luck Cause guess what? I got a truck I got a junk truck Block well, come pick you up in my junk truck Looks like you're in luck I got a junk truck Junk truck, junk truck, junk truck. I'll come load your junk up in my truck. It won't even cost you a buck. You just say the word, you know I'll jump. And I will haul your junk to the dump in my junk truck. I'll come pick you up in my junk truck Won't cost you a buck, I got a junk truck Junk truck A junk truck Junk truck Please, no dancing should go and get drunk I'll come pick you up in my truck and after we get drunk we can talk in my junk truck I'll come pick you up in my junk truck and we can go get drunk in my junk truck junk truck junk truck junk truck a toast to Jason's, all y'all and your mom and them. Cheers. <laughs> so I see um, the true fans got here early and got the good seats down here. Hell yeah. We got, we got the good seats in the high tops. We grabbed them high top seats. We got here early. Yeah. So, um, I know you can't tell by looking at me, but I used to live in a mobile home. <laughs> Real. I did, yeah, that's true. I know, hard to believe. And I wrote this song about those days back there living in that there trailer. It's called Summer Rain. I 
I don't have a lot of money, but I just paid off my double wide. Never had much time for a honey, but I always wished I had one by my side. Lately, there's this girl that caught my fancy, living in that trailer next to mine. She told me that her name is Nancy. I think she knows, I think she's really fine. And summer rain keeps coming through my window, but it's too hot to keep it closed at night. Well, I know that someday I'll have to find a way to try to keep that window locked up tight. I found out Nancy has a boyfriend. He's a biker type, they call him Savage Stew. He works as a bouncer at the strip club. Turns out that's where Nancy's working too. And Nancy had to get herself a stage name. And Stu, he drinks too much to ease his head. And when she's on the pole, they call her Summer Rain. Then she goes home and puts drunk Stu to bed. And summer rain keeps coming through my window. But it's too hot to keep it closed at night. I know that someday I'm have to find a way to try to keep that window locked up tight. Yes, yeah, summer rain keeps coming through my window. But it's too hot to keep it closed at night. Well, I know that someday I'll have to find a way to try to keep that window locked up tight. I'll try to keep that window locked up tight. So she was a stripper. Yeah, she was. <laughs> I didn't know if you picked up on that. <laughs> and your lock was broke on the window. <laughs> yeah, I got a, got a broken window. I'll get to that eventually. No, you won't. <laughs> Man, what a party. <laughs> Two Jasons. What? You know, I see there's a lot of musicians in the room. I see a lot of my friends out there, the musicians that are out here supporting other musicians. And I think as a guitarist specifically, I can, I can make these people relate to what we go through. See, when you're a guitar player, nail care is very important. And you know, because if you get a little catch or something in that nail, well, you gotta take care of it. You could tear it, it could get infected. And so the other day, it just happened to me the other day. I had a nail, it had a little, little tear in it. So I got my little clippers and my file out of my pocket that I always carry with me. And I, and, and I started working at people in the restaurant were disgusted. But then I finally finished up, put my sock and shoe back on, and everybody was fine after that. <laughs> I wrote this song because I watched the movie Goodfellas way too many times.
Hello, honey. Tell me about your day. You're all that I've been thinking about since I went away. But me and Eddie got this thing, this thing we got to do. As soon as we take care of that, I'm headed home to you. And I'm almost home. Just need to find a gun. I'm almost home. Oh, I really miss you, hon. I'm almost home. I need a ski mask and gloves, and then I'm almost home. Home to you, my love. Tell me about the kids. They doing well in school? Jimmy's selling weed? Wow, that's pretty cool. And little Joey's taking bets on the high school football game? Well, he's a chip off the old block. That's why he shares my name, man, I'm almost home. Just need to get some rope, I'm almost home. Back into your loving arms, I hope. I'm almost home, I gotta bust a couple heads and then I'm almost home. To snuggle up with you in bed. Some couples find themselves caught up in a bind. Sometimes the middle ground can seem so hard to find. Separate your career and marriage, it's the best way by far. Your job is what you do, it isn't who you are. And I'm almost home, I just gotta find some duct tape. I'm almost home, I'm so glad you made me keep in shape. I'm almost home, cause I gotta dig this big hole. And then I'm almost home. I love you, heart and soul. We had that thing in Cleveland that Tony had us stop. Over in Detroit, Paulie skimming off the top. And then a quick stop at Chicago, breaks some loser's legs. But don't you worry, honey. I'll pick up the milk and eggs. And I'm almost home. Just need to steal a car. I'm almost home. Love has come so far. I'm almost home. Uh oh, the cops are on my tail. I'm almost home. Can you come post my bail? Oh, come on, honey. There's some money in the sugar bowl. And that hollowed out Bible's got some money in it. You can hit up Tony for the rest. He knows I'm good for it. Hello? Hello, honey? Hello, Karen? Karen! So, um, Jason, Jason told us to uh, mention the magic tip jar here. I, it is magic. I don't know if you guys understand this, the magic that happens with this tip jar up here. But every time you put a tip into the magic tip jar, an abandoned puppy finds a new home. Uh, so, you know, I'm not putting any pressure on you. If you want the puppies to die, that's okay. No worry, it's, I understand. But if you want to help the puppies, there's a tip jar right down here, and the magic will happen. <laughs> Are there any questions? No? Okay, well that concludes the question and answer period of the show tonight. If you have any more questions, come to the next show and we will try to come up with an answer for you. Oh, the pu there are some puppies just got saved. Oh, God bless that woman. She's probably got it. Oh, another one. Oh, there's a special place in heaven for you guys. <laughs> Speaking of tip jar, this song I wrote about being broke.
I reach into my pockets, and all I got is lint. Ain't got a nickel, not one red cent, and I'm wondering how to pay the rent. My baby walked in, she said, boy, don't be such a jerk. Get off the couch, just go to work. You wouldn't be wondering how to pay the rent. Oh, that'll help. <laughs> I'm just gonna put my stuff out in the yard. Sell my comic books and baseball cards. Sell my golf clubs and fishing poles. I'm even gonna sell almost all of my clothes. They say that one man's trash is another man's treasure. By Sunday evening, I had the pleasure. I wasn't wondering how to pay the rent. Skippity bop, oh, rapidly bold. Skeet up, skeep, skeep, skeepity bold. Rapidly bow, bow, skeepity bop, bow. Baby walked in, she saw that big pile of cash. She snatched it up, she was gone in a flash. She wasn't wondering how to pay the rent. She got a new dress, a new pair of shoes. She got a brand new purse, a new tattoo. She went out on the town drinking top shelf booze. She left me sitting here with these garage sale blues. So I'm reaching into my pockets, and it's still just lint. Ain't got a nickel, not one red cent. I'm still wondering how to pay the rent. Yes, I'm wondering how to pay the rent. Thanks for the tip jar donations, folks. <laughs> so um, I'm gonna I'm gonna try to wrap things up here so we can get the Jasons up here. Is everybody ready to see them? They were like they were like go up there and board. Oh, another puppy just got saved. Oh. They were like, go up there and bore the shit out of these people so that we sound really good. <laughs> this song about my car. I could use to jump after this show, by the way. <laughs> Who said that? No. No, it's a Honda. <laughs> I'm the proud owner of a 2003 Chevy Avalanche. I don't know, I just felt like I should throw that in for this gentleman over here. I love my truck. They say she likes a four-wheel drive, she likes an SUV. She's crazy about a muscle car or a classic Model T. She even likes a limousine. None of that's for me. I just need a way to get from point A to point B. Love my car, it's a beater with a heater. Goes pretty far, but it's a real gas eater. She don't like what I drive. I don't want to meet her. Love my car. It's a beater with a heater. True story, folks. I 
might have to change the tire or glue the mirror back on. Radio, it always works, but the stations might be gone. Sometimes I gotta smack the dash when I turn on the lights. Sometimes I roll down the windows, drive around all night. Love my car, it's a beater with a heater. Don't go fast, but I never was a speeder. If she don't like what I drive, I don't want to meet her. Love my car, is a beater with a heater. I'm gonna take a sing around the block now. She made it. So you can have your custom van, you're fast and furious. You can keep that big sedan that's so luxurious. I don't want no hybrid car or monster pickup truck. And lights are out the back seat, so we got a place to sleep. Love my car, it's a beater with a heater. Got four doors, but it's only a two-seater. She don't like what I drive. I don't want to meet her. Love my car. It's a beater with heater. Love my car. It's a beater with heater. Anybody got jumper cables? All right, fellas, I'm going to do one more song. Two more. Are, are, are the, you guys cool with that? One more? I'm just going to do one more. Two more. Because um, this place is going to probably ban me for life after this song. So I see some... This place is full of some young people. I see a lot of young people. But I see us old folks out there too. Oh no, darling, you're a young one. You're a young one. <laughs> I color my hair too. But I see some fellows in my demographic, the um, over 50 ilk. And um, I wrote this song for us. And and if and if you're under if you're a guy under fifty, this is just a fair warning. I'm getting older, more concerned about my health. Just like they say, it's more important than your wealth. I'm in my fifties. It's time to be a man. I called the doctor for a physical exam. He checked my nose. He looked inside my ears. Asked if I smoked, if I drank a lot of beers. He checked my lungs. He listened to my heart. It was going great, but then it all fell apart. He stuck his finger in my butt. He grazed her up, boy. And I'll tell you what, I would have bet I wouldn't let some guy stick his finger in my butt. I gotta tell you, it came as a surprise. It took my breath away and bugged out my eyes. It didn't hurt that much and I'm not really sore. I just assumed I might resist a little more. When he stuck that finger in my butt, he 
he greased her up, boy. And I'll tell you what, I would have bet I wouldn't let some guy stick his finger in my butt. Why do you do it twice? Today's modern medicine can cause my thoughts to linger. All this technology and they still just use their finger. Well, I'm not mad. I'll never shed a tear. Just kind of sad I gotta wait another year. Pissing <laughs> his finger in my butt. He'll grease her up, boy. And I'll tell you what. I would have bet I wouldn't let some guy stick his finger in my butt. <laughs> thank you, everybody. I thank you, uh, Jason, for asking me to be a part of this great night. Please, uh, they have CDs for sale. If, if you are the people that still own CD players, please buy a CD from them. Stickers, t-shirts, anything that helps. Support, the, support local, independent, original music. God bless you all. Ladies and gentlemen, get loud one more time for Chris Wolf. I can't wait till I turn 50. Anybody? Uh, drop to my truck. Let me move the car seat first of all. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, two things I'm gonna say about the two Jasons. Yeah. First of all, best name. What a great name. Two Jasons. So easy to remember. Not only is their music great, but also their personalities are out of this world. They're two of the most kind gentlemen that you will ever meet. And as a songwriter, to quote Allen Ginsberg, we stand naked on the stage and bear our emotions to you guys. And so it is a lot. We are vulnerable when we do it. And uh, it is a very cool experience to come off the stage and hear either Jason say, awesome song, man, great song. And so uh, I just love how they support music and I love how they make music. Um, the other thing I wanted to say was they're just awesome. If you have not already, if you don't need to buy the CD, well, you should buy the CD, but if you need to stream their album, I took last week, listened to it like three times. It is a very outstanding album. I love their music, I love these guys. And I love the fact that they brought us together and I love the fact that they packed Moondrop Distillery. So please give them a huge round of applause and give them all the love in the world. Ladies and gentlemen, to Jason. Holy shit, holy shit. Look at all these faces out here tonight. I'm hot. I'm hot. We good? I don't know. We're... Yeah, we expected a pretty decent turnout. Not this. But this is, uh, you guys, you guys went above and beyond. Yeah. I mean, seriously, we're not this good. quick this tip jar up here right on the stage all the money in that tip jar is going to Matthew Stewart Chris Wolf we might give Elizabeth a little 
She does all right. But we ain't taking none of that. That is for them. And help yourself to the merch over there. Thanks for coming out. First song is Gold. Let's go. song right now seems everything's going too good I'll admit that bums me out a little more than it probably should they can all be gold we ain't doing nothing wrong just make sure you're ready when a good one comes along don't get down and out try to sell your Got a great smile and a pretty mean style And I used to got away with words I'd write a hundred songs for a good one comes along Then I sing it like a goddamn bird Brand new feeling when you gotta keep dealing No one ever paid attention before With the wolves at the door and a world full of more I'm just in my nose So you're ready when a good one comes along and Don't get down in and out Try to sell your soul If you don't like one, not another They can all be gold Well, there's worse things than making noise Screaming out into the void With rhythm deep in your soul Picking and rhyming and digging for diamonds, so all we seem to find is gold. Do what you gotta do, waiting on the full moon and angel to rock your own. When it all goes clear, she might whisper in your ear a little something that you can't let go. And it might be gold. We ain't doing Make sure you're ready when a good one comes along. Don't get down and out and try to sell your soul. Sell your soul. Sell your soul. If you don't like one, not another. They can all be gold. Too, Matthew. Matthew, a little guitar monitor and uh, a little vocal. What are we doing next, brother? Butterflies already. I wrote this song about, I don't know, whenever, a while back. It's about a bike trip I did down to, you know, all over down south, riding around on my motorcycle being free.
think I'd be well, but it didn't take long. For them to find out that I also like Lily Payne. Their night moved slow, cause it was all. lot of people in this room that I've spent a lot of time in bars with. And we're doing it again. Look at us. Woo! We're not too old to party. No. <laughs> this song is about that very thing. It's called Neon Dream. It was written from the perspective of being in a bar. Try, try, try 
coming up, I don't wanna go home. Back to my life, back to paying the toll. The light is so bright, don't wanna deal with this shit. Like a puzzle where none of the pieces quite fit. There's something about the night, everything looks better under me. Beautiful chaos and I'm watching it all Thanks y'all Guys are too kind Stuart Poe on the slide guitar over here. 
This man has been a good friend to us. He's a hell of a guitar player. We didn't write this album with any themes in mind, but when I listen to it, I hear characters that are concerned with the passing of time and uh, trying to better themselves to make the world a little better place than what they left it. I think I hear that in almost every song that we write. And we're happy to be surrounded by friends that feel the same way. I like to thank all the guys that opened up for us. Well, Stuart for playing with us. Chris Wolf for being a legend, Woo! playing our songs. And Matthew Marcel for just being an awesome human being. That dude has got the best energy. Yeah. And we love having him around. Plus, he's a bad motherfucker. As a younger man, I lie, often give in to my pride, always talking, rarely listening, going out most every night, I drink until the morning light, ending up where I Chasing dreams Consumed by things That I didn't need Too many friends Too many enemies and Time flies Like an arrow One thing leads to another So many days and chances and only hold so many loves. But if you travel through these doors, and my bones look the same as yours. Play the hand until you're done. Looked into a wife, built ourselves a life. No more fighting, all my wars alone. We did five, six, six. I'm saying more by saying less. There's a purpose in this place where I belong. If I make it till I'm great, I hope I learn from my mistakes. I hope I did my best with my back against the 
Appreciate you guys listening. There's so many of you in this room. <laughs> Holy shit. Uh, it's kind yeah, of crazy. It's a great crowd. Woo. We got a lot of mid tempo ballads for you guys. I apologize. Uh, the next album is all just boot stomp and barn burners with Matthew Marcel. Yeah. We'll see you guys here in about 24 months. <laughs> Yeah, I think. Hey 
give it up for Stuart Poe. We'll call him back up here in just a bit. This song is the longest song that I've ever tried to write. It's a song that took me like three years to write because it was important to me to get it right. It's a song about my grandpa and a Cadillac and a young man. There's the one that likes it. I remember this car. Yeah. The song's called Granddad's Cadillac. Car. Even the ones we wrote that, that are just made up. A lot of have, a lot of have a truth There's in them. There's still truth in them. Yeah. I wrote this song during that stupid fucking time when they told us we weren't allowed to do nothing. And I'm only doing it tonight because Chris Wolf's here and I fucking love that man so much. And I think he likes this song. When you start believing 
even in the TV Holding your hand to the news Yeah, you think so clever No one can do Don't choose what's right Then you get what's left Well, all purpose Meaning what you think is best But there are so many you Nothing left to hold on to anymore. What if I told you it's a lie? We ain't got a fucking thing to do with picking sides. Both hands are there to keep us on the road. Hey, long before our time. What if I showed you it's a lie? Picking signs, both hands are there to keep us on the road. They long for our time. They sent us a message to wake up. We traded the center of our world for life. We watched executive decision. Kiss all of our liberties goodbye. Shocking all on the cable news. Down the little black rectangles, we all seem to choose to give our full attention to instead of what is right before our eyes. This is the first song on the album. So we have two two albums. It's a double album, Whiskey and Water. Uh, Whiskey's kind of the the real album. Water's somewhat b-sides but some of those would have made whiskey if we were doing a longer album yeah they were just meaningful songs that we wanted to record but this song was uh i wrote this song and it was it was just lacking it, it needed something and I, I reached out to jason and i i said put some trippy ass guitar on this song and by god he put some trippy ass guitar on this song so normally, you know, you go on tour, you go tour over in England or something to get good at it. We don't get to do that, so we're going to give you the best version we got tonight. We still ain't great at this song, we're going to give you hell. Y'all are lucky because we practiced two times for this show, which is two times more, than we, more than we normally practice. way more than we normally practice, yeah. We're not good at practicing. We just do what we do.
Most times I'm straight as steel Sometimes a winding wheel Scar like an old live oak Standing in a field alone Just a wishing on a star As everything falls apart I know these two shall pass The good things they ought to last Cause life can't get you high Life can't beat you down Ain't no point in asking why Goes around, comes around Goes around, comes around I go in with her With my expectations low Then I won't apologize For this thunder raging in my soul I know that I've lost So pull me something strong Cause life is just a song Turn the lights down low Drop a needle on something with soul Cause life can't get you high Life can't beat you Goes around, comes around. Goes around, comes around. Thanks, y'all. That went okay. We've done better, but that was okay. There it is. So, Matthew, are you, you still? Can I get a little more monitor on the guitar, please? Just, I mean, just do he it. He said no, dude. Just do it, dude. So this song, you know, I'm a blue collar worker. I do shit with my hands. And I spend a lot of time eating lunch at gas stations here and there. Stupid bullshit like that. And uh, I have a lot of little exchanges with people that you don't know. I don't even know their names. 
And uh, sometimes there's a little flicker of a little fire in there. It's something that could be, but you ain't gonna let it be. That's what this song's about, falling in love with the girl at the gas station, or the Home Depot, or wherever the fuck they work at. And it's Home Depot. I'm a happily married man, I ain't fucking around. But every now and again I get that look that says, hey bud, you wanna party? Not a day rolls by, I don't roll through a line. A little light is on. It's just hello, thank you, and have a nice day. With a twinkle of an eye, and that's all. She seems like a real nice girl. She's probably got a family. She's just trying to make her own living. It's the same as me Sometimes I let my mind wander It's a natural thing to do I play out the words in my head I wish I could say to you You got eyes Me a band Mouthful of southern honey. What time you get off tonight, baby? Take a ride with me. Roll out to these flatlands. Find us a toss in the trees. Kick open the doors to my van. Slip on down to the creek. Help you with them buttons. If you help me with these boots, all the sound of that calm, cool water while we do the things we do. On such a perfect night, we can lay out and look at the stars. I will tell you my whole damn story. I'll show you my scar. I'm sorry, what'd you just say? No, I don't need a receipt. I guess my mind was just drifting on. No, I haven't been getting much sleep. You got eyes like me a band and a mouthful of southern honey. What time you get off tonight, baby? Wanna take a ride with me? Roll out through these flatlands, find us a tall stand of trees. Kick open the doors to my van. We're on some over here. You got eyes. Me a bandini in a mouthful of southern honey. What time do you get off tonight, baby? Won't you take a ride with me? Thanks, y'all. Oh, now to tell you what, this next song, this guy wrote this song a few years ago. And he's played every now and again. Stuart, where you at? He played every now and again, and I'd be like, yeah, it's a good song, bud. And until we, until we put it on the album, I didn't realize how good it was. Matthew turned Stuart up. We're about to go. So I want to remind you again, we got stickers, matches, what else is free? Guitar picks, all kinds of bull bullshit over there. And there's some up on the stage. Get you a new shirt. I don't know if we sold out yet. I kind of figure we might tonight. Uh, Those are the softest shirts. They are very made. soft. They are good on the nipples. 
nipples will not chafe in those shirts. <laughs> the old shirts, you might get a little nipple chafe. The new ones, I they're paid real. extra so you don't. They're, they're certified, certified yeah. nipple friendly. Right there. That's a nipple friendly shirt. No. <laughs> a couple more drinks I might. I made this song up. Jason wrote, talking about trying to be good people. This song is about being good people.
built my life around the kindness of women and strangers. Favorite luck and dreams, it seems, help me stumble through this world just like a child. song. This is a stupid song. Uh, I mean, it's not real stupid, but it's it's pretty stupid. Oh man, this song's all right. This song was never intended to be recorded or played out. Uh, Jason and I have been friends for long like, damn time. Forty years, long long time. Let's rub our wieners together, bud. <laughs> That's an inside joke, and uh, this song was inside jokes. I wrote this song to make Jason laugh. It had a lot of inside jokes. And then there's a song that we love. We love Hank Williams Jr. If you don't love Hank Williams, then you can kiss my ass. And that's a song that Hank Jr. wrote about his daddy. It's called, If You Don't Love Hank Williams, You Can Kiss My Ass. There's a line in that song that says, 
I'm in love with Linda Ronstadt. And so this song was born from that line. We used to laugh about that. How he just put it right out there, shooting a shot with Linda. Uh, so I wrote this song to make you laugh, and then people seem to like it. We keep playing it, and here we are. The song's called Ronstadt. This song's better the drunker we are. I'm feeling yeah, about it. Yeah, we don't eight. normally play this sober. Hold on. Hey, why don't you guys drink with us for a second? Bring it over here, brother. Thank you guys for coming out, for showing out. It's amazing. That's right. This is amazing. We're gonna do a couple more and then we're gonna take a little break. Stuart's gonna play a couple songs and then we'll come up and finish it off with a couple more. Wrap it up around 10 -ish. And if I ain't said it yet, take care of Rachel and them back there at the bar. They are working there. They take care of us. This place, yeah. Moondrops, has been so good to us. Yeah, love this place and their whiskey is pretty good. We would pick a place to have this show at a place that creates whiskey. It's, you know us, it makes sense.
guy Trading songs and telling lies Playing moon drops on a Saturday song a long time ago you know honestly a lot of these songs some of uh, some of them I wrote a long time ago on this album we just this is our big dump like hey yeah, we got all these songs we want y'all to hear them and this is one that wrote a long time ago go uh, some people like it some people just think it's okay that's how they feel about us, though. Like, you yeah, know, either, no that's one a, hates that's us. That's the story right? of our like, life, right? There's nobody out there. I don't some think people hates like us. it. Some people just some think people like us. Some people I think, think we're all right. Hey, that one guy, he fucking hates us. That one dude does. Ah. Yeah, that one dude. So he's like one guy. Hey, Elizabeth, you want to come up here? Turn her mic on, Matthew.
Stevie B on deck. Hey, this is our uh, our last song, the first. Well, kind of. We're gonna come back and do a couple more here in a minute, but yeah, this is our first set. We're gonna uh, Stuart Poe's gonna play a few. We're gonna mingle yep. and say hi. There's surely some of y'all out there that I've been wanting to give a hug and say hi to. This is probably the wrong choice of a song to follow that song. Oh, it's a great song. I love this song. Turn a blind eye, ain't nothing gonna happen to me. The edge of our place, the little biotechnology. Searching for hope through the clouds and the wind and the rain. If you live by the tracks too long, you stop hearing the train. Shame is not what it used to be. So easy to lie, so quick to steal and cheat. Everything is so loud, I'm too lost to be found, it seems. It's crumbling down while we're stumbling around asleep. There's a sound that I keep hearing. It's distant, yeah, so plain. Is there light at the end of this tunnel? Or is it just a train? Or is it just a train? truths are simple, you do or you don't, and choices ain't accidental, you will or you won't, life is a prize, create a life, open to all that could be, or fail to learn, crash and burn, rinse off and repeat, there's a sound that I keep hearing, it's distant yet so plain. Is the light at the end of this tunnel? Or is it just a train? Or is it just a train? Lift me up, make me strong, put me right where I belong, like the words to all those crystal songs. But the dawn's as cold, though it's warm in my soul. The sun cuts a path through the night. I pick up my sword and ready myself. Cause all is revealed in the light. All is revealed in the light. There's a sound that I keep hearing. It's distant yet so plain. Is there a light at the end of this tunnel? Think about train noises. 
thing about a big steam locomotive coming at you down the pipe. Jason's album, you'll hear him featured in there, rolling those slide guitars. But ladies and gentlemen, please put your hand together for Stuart Poe. Hello. Thanks, everybody. I'm going to do a couple songs here, and then the Jasons are going to get back up and finish it off. So let's hear it for the two Jasons, everybody. Great. When I drink tea, flick up on my plastic cup. It reminds me that I need to look you up. See what rock you're under. See what shape you're in. When I get down, I wonder where you've been. Well, I live my life with the next cheap thrill. They say I represent a weak will. But I never waste a second. Never waste a drop. Never waste my mind with thoughts to stop. Well, I dreamed of you in a scarlet fever haze Running through the burning woods, it was the end of days You yelled a curse and you screamed a prayer And I woke up and I left you there And I woke up and I left you there Thanks, everybody. I was on this uh, public domain project that two Jasons played a song too on it. Um, I'm gonna do a song I did from that. It's called uh, Brendan on the Moor. It's an old Irish song. We got St. Patrick's Day right around the corner here. Well, let's have a brave young high women. This story I will tell. And his name is William Brennan. And in Ireland he did dwell. It was on the Kilroyd Mountains. He commenced his wild career. Many well. Hey, 
brave and undaunted was young Brennan. One day upon that highway, as Brennan he went down, well, he met the mayor of Cashel, a mile outside of town, and the mayor he knew his features, and he said, man, said he, your name is William Brennan, you must come along. And undaunted was young Brennan. Now Brennan's wife had gone to town for visions for to buy. The wish she saw her Willie, she commenced to weep and cry. He said, Hand to me that tenpenny. And as soon as Willie spoke, she handed him a blunderbuss from underneath her cloak. And it's Brennan on the moor. Brennan on the moor. Brave and undaunted was young Brennan. Now with this loaded blunderbuss, the truth I will unfold. Well, he made the mayor to tremble, and he robbed him of his gold. One hundred pounds was offered for his apprehension there. So he took horse and saddle to the mountains to repair. And it's Brennan on the moor, Brennan on the moor. Brave and undaunted was your Brennan. Now Brennan being an outlaw upon the mountainside, with cavalry and infantry to but he laughed at them with scorn Till at last he said By a false-hearted young man He was cruelly dread And it's Brennan on the moor Brennan on the moor Brave and undaunted Was young Brennan And it's Brennan on the moor Brennan on the moor Brave and undaunted Was young Brennan
one more and get to see Jason back up here, baby. everybody. We're going to get the two Jasons back up here to finish it off. Try to respect the time and energy of those at Moondrops that got to clean up after all this shit. We're gonna do two, maybe three more. This song, uh, this song here. There's a gentleman out there in a sexy beard and a sexy cowboy hat. Where's he at? By the there name of Shannon, is. the mountain man. And his beautiful lady sitting there. Beautiful lady and their friends. He wrote the words to this song. And then this tall drink of water here. Took those words and put them to music. The song's called Starlight in the Morning. Step on the choir. 
Tonight's about two Jasons, and I don't want to take anything away from that. But me and Miss Elizabeth here on the cello, we play in a group that's recently formed called High Water Troubadours. And we got some songs and some gigs and some crap. We're just doing stuff on the in-between, you know? Did I, did I dangle your strap? Raj wrote this song a while back. We've done it forever. I think he tried to let it go. And I said, no, I like this song. Let's keep it going. We ended up ending the double album. This is the last song on Water. We're going in the night with the album songs tonight. We're done with this song. We're gonna get Matthew, whoever else wants to come up, grab a guitar, sing, whatever. And we'll do an old, uh, was it a Little Feet song? I think uh, maybe Linda Ronstadt did it. Yeah, well, of course, that's our version we like. So, but thank you guys so much. Yeah, for thank tonight. you for hanging out all night. Thank, thank you, you for being here. Y'all have been super kind to us, and we really, really appreciate it. So this song's called "Hurts the Same." Start made, us out. I made bro. my strap too short. Now I'm like a <laughs> was it a, mid, a midget and a turtleneck? That's what I feel like right now. I'm sorry. That's not. You're not allowed to say that anymore, are you? <laughs> Little people turtleneck. Hey, 
face screamers, narrow minded leaders, hijack the American dream. And time moves on. Yesterday is dead and gone. Cello. It's just C. -E. You think there'd be an H in there, but there ain't. Matthew, Stewart, anybody? We're gonna do Willin' and we're gonna call it a night. Actually, we had a request for a song off our first album that we're gonna probably play acoustic up here after we Later, shut the yeah. stage off. I don't fucking remember that. Come on, baby, we got it. We got it. Kendra's been a dear friend to us. She was in a slow mo video with us in the '90s. <laughs> you remember this? I didn't until just now. Now you know. I think we got third place for that video. <laughs> hey, thank you guys for hanging out. This has been one of the best nights of, I can remember in quite a while. We've been building towards this for uh, about 20, 30 years. Uh, like, I don't know. It's, it's uh, top of the mountain, two Jasons, and we couldn't do it without you. He'd have told us when we walked into Chris Wolf's open mic 2017. We'd have a room full of people here to see songs we made up in our head. I would not have believed you. That's right. But it's awesome. Thank you for supporting us. I did not write this song. You did not write this song. We think Little Feet wrote this song. We're not sure we who do, wrote this song. We do the Linda Ronstadt version. Stu says Little Feet wrote it. Stuart's like the encyclopedia of musical knowledge. That ain't no joke.